loss of a Detroit radio legend. Mike Clark, the famed Jew and Mike show has passed away. For years, Metro Detroiters woke up listening to the pair on WRIF and now news of Mike's sudden death is sending shockwaves through the industry. 7 Action News reporter Simon Trowdery talked with his longtime co-host Drew Lane about how he's remembering his friend. For many years, Drew and Mike had dominated the airwaves at the Riff, but Mike Clark's laugh and sense of humor is what Drew says he'll miss the most. Surprise, shock, um, you know, sad. When Drew Lane got the call that his radio partner and longtime friend had died, he almost couldn't believe it. It's just starting to hit me now, really. They had spoken only hours before Mike Clark passed away overnight. I just know he died in his sleep, which uh, he many times said was how I wanted to die. So <laughs> I know it's really weird that I know that, but he, uh, Mike wasn't shy about sharing his passions and his feelings on virtually anything. The last conversation they had was about baseball and John Lennon songs. The two have worked together for more than 20 years. Drew says listeners may not have known this, but Mike was a very sensitive and charitable person who enjoyed flying and adored his fans, but most importantly, loved his family. Really happy with his wife and they spent, I mean, they were hardly ever apart. And so that part's really sad. The Drew and Mike show was on the riff until 2013. Three years later, they started a podcast. Mike appeared less frequently while battling health issues. Drew is still processing the grief, but says there is one thing he will never forget about his dear friend. What I miss about Mike, it would be his laugh. I mean, he was just had an incredibly infectious laugh. And Drew plans on hosting a podcast tonight solely dedicated to Mike. In Ferndale, Simon Chowdhury, 7 Action News. And right now on our website, WXYZ.com, you'll find a photo gallery of Drew and Mike's last morning on WRIF. And while you're there, be sure to leave your condolences.